I've been streaming Animal Crossing less and less, so we're approaching the end of the burbs. Well, not necessarily the ending of it, I mean, it's uh, just a matter of it being less. But I'll probably come back from time to time to revisit. There's gonna be an alien invasion. Animals are gonna die. And then, we can stop. Animal Crossing. From Ketchup. The day for me to move is here, but what if I'm really lonely in my new town? Hey, you should come with me. Is that too selfish of me to ask? Never mind, I guess. Well, fuck off, Ketchup. I tried to get you to not move! That Ketchup is just straight up gone. It's like you think you know someone, and then they're just gone. I was like, walking in front of her and shit. Trying to get her attention, so she would be like, Oh, I'm moving! Stop me! Yet... Inkwell is still here. That's funny. Weren't you supposed to leave, Inkwell? If it isn't, fine. Been a while. I'm not gonna pry into what you've been doing when you were gone. Glad you're okay. You are okay, right? Now, Cherry, we, we know how you pry. There's a rumor going around, you heard? Everyone's saying Vine is quite the bell pincher. <laughs> now, that's definitely a euphemism, right? Because you know what a bell end is. I kind of see what they're talking about. What, what? What do you mean? I'm not pinching my bell right now. S shut up. A lot of stuff has happened while you've been gone. Like, I got a new comic book. Let me tell you, that was pretty exciting, Quacko. These poor animals. They don't... They really don't have a whole lot going on. I almost feel like I just got guilt tripped. I got this time capsule I made. If I bury it myself, I'll, I'll give in to temptation. I... am a master at burying time capsules. I've only opened one of them. Fucking legend in the babs! Check it out, future me. This thing is old, but it's still pretty nice. I can't bring myself to throw it away. Maybe future me can use it as a dish rag or something from past me. Did you need something? Uh, actually... What were you thinking? You can't open someone else's time capsule. It's against the rules! Just give it to me, then. What? This time capsule is empty! This time capsule isn't even really a time capsule, Quacko. What could have happened to it? And this is why Ketchup moved. Turns out I betray the ducks that live here. I can't help it. They're just... so easy to betray. They're so trusting. And their little flippers couldn't hurt a soul. Well, I haven't seen you in like a really long time. I'm glad you decided to leave your house and get outside for a bit. Hi Vine, what's going on, Dioing? I've developed a recent interest in squid ecology, Vine. Ooh. Well, you should take a look right down there, because we got a squid checking you out. It would be fascinating to have one at home for research purposes. Could you catch one for me? Yeah. I, I, can, I can catch a squid for you. Just give me a second. No? What? No talk, no rumors, no nothing? Ah, uh, barbells. Yeah, I got some rumors. That Coco here is really into your ecology. Hey, Scoot. The deed is done. I've betrayed Drake. That's my pal, bro. You're too good to me. Put your fucking shirt back on. You had a good shirt. Oh, look, Ganon. Wow, you're a real dickwad. You know that? You're a real fuckstick. Fuck, I kind of want you gone now. No, we're gonna take you down. Soon. You got something you want to say to me? Is it Crenando? I usually is, actually. <laughs> what do you think? Don't I look particularly sharp today? Do you ever say something different, Ganon? Holy shit. What's wrong with you? If you say that one more time, I'm never speaking to you again. What?! Ganon is broken. That's three times in a row, the same dialogue. I guess I have to kick him out of the town. I said I would never speak to him again. Let's go visit Ketchup. Oh. Someone's camping for the first time. Oh, shit. Are you okay? What the fuck happened to your face? I'll be seeing you around for a little bit. Rouch. I wanted to replace Ketchup with another duck. But then again, I guess, you know, having your skin removed, uh, the least I could do is move you in. You should move here. Whoa, where'd this come from? I'm happy you'd invite me, but I'm not sure. I need some time to think about this. Oh, idea time. How about a game? If you win, I'll move here. If if you lose, I have to get your axe. Or I get to have your axe. What? 
Rock, paper, scissors. We'll play it once. I'll lay it down all. Lay it all down on the line. Uh-oh. You got me. That means you win the game. Oh, deal's a deal. Guess I'll be moving here soon. So much to do that I gotta get start getting ready. Let's see. Your name is Vine, right? Pleased to meet you, Vine. Wait a minute. What, what were you gonna do with an axe? What was Lucky gonna do with an axe? Fucking God. That is... It's a weird item to request. Check this out. Yep, I got a ball catcher. What do you want? Oh, you want a fruit. Oh. <laughs> Tasty as ever. Here, I want you to have my bear costume in return for me getting the fruit. <laughs> Why do you have this, Scoot? What the fuck? You should be wearing this, not me. Whoa, what was going on there? So you're getting stalked, Drake. Uh, yeah, I just wanted to tell you I'm sorry about your time capsule. Wow, what are you doing with a bear costume? I've always wanted one of those. Let's make a deal. Want to trade my bear costume for my round cactus? It's like a chode, almost. Sweet. Okay, then here we go. Drake's been trying to get this costume from Scoot for years. It's a very strange thing to... A, want, and then B, give me. What do you want, Inkwell? You're next. I'm not talking to you anymore, Ganon. I'm serious, we're done. You're- you're getting removed. So I need a squid for Coco. Coco, I think, is just- really just wants anything. Could be a duck, it could be a squid. Could be a fuck, it could be a kid. Where did Coco go go? Whoa, what the hell? I can't believe how late it is. Today was just so much fun, I lost track of time doing. Cherry, can you wait, like, a second? I'm busy. And Cherry no longer cares. God damn it, Cherry. Cherry, did you have something specific? I think Cherry's just really nosy. Man, Ganon and Molly are really tight. What? What? Ganon and Molly? That doesn't make any sense. What, what, what does Molly want to bring about the end of the world? That citrus aroma you're smelling is the smell of youthful ambition. I had some people say my place just smells like a gym. Nah, dude. It's the Ass Pounder 4000. It's just... Just a watermelon. Well, you know what? Yes. Harv, I need a watermelon. Thank you. Ugh, still spreading disease, Bella? It's totally fine. Look, she's wearing a, a skull shirt. No shit you're wearing a skull shirt. That's the, the fucking symbol of death. You bring plague. Hey, Bob. Oh, it's fine. Ah, I'm done being surprised now. Here in the burbs today to do some shopping. Hope I score some good stuff. Man, have I got some bad news for you, Bob. I woke up today at a reasonable time. I got to do things. I haven't done things in a while. <clears throat> and then I actually got myself a proper lunch, and then I went and, uh, did some music. It was good. That's a lot of mail I've got. Fuck. Coco, toss! Ketchup, toss! Ketchup left. Cherry. By the time you've read this, I'll be long gone. I gotta get a move on so I can scope out my new turf, you know? <laughs> I'm gonna get everything I've got in my new town from Gutsy Cherry. I- I had nothing to do with this. I had no inclination that Cherry was thinking of leaving. This is officially the second time Cherry has left. <laughs> from Cherry. Remember that time capsule you buried for me before? I moved away, so can I ask you to dig it up? If you do, you can keep what's inside. I know what she put in there, it's a fucking bomb. I mean, you know, you just try so hard to please these animals. Fucking animals. Well, I have to fix the overlay now. Gotta- gotta move on in life, you know what I mean? Cyrus took care of me at retail the other day. He is so cool. What do you mean, took care of you, Scoot? Look, even Drake is like, what the hell's going on? Did you see Drake's face? He's like, I don't think I wanted to overhear that. You see what you've done, Scoot? Now everyone here is confused and staring at us. Guess we don't need this shit anymore. Cherry came cl too close to the truth. Oh, look, it's our new... Did Cherry have to move so Lucky could move in? 
Southbird, here's where you would put the Tim and Eric clip of the mind blown. You just go, and it's like the universe exploding. Whoa, Vine, do you remember me? I'm lucky. Back when I came to camp here, you were like, why don't you just move here? So that's what I did. I've been here for about a week now. I'm glad we finally ran into each other. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. What is that? Stop saying that. I heard a rumor about you. Yeah, a bell pincher. It's a good rumor. I heard sc <laughs> Scoot was a bit of a bell pincher, to be honest. It is a bell pincher. Let's see what else is going on in town. Oh, someone's camping here. If it's Cherry, I'm gonna end this series right now. For good. Alright, hello, octopus. Marina. I hope it's alright that I've decided to camp here. You have a lovely town. I enjoy company, so please come visit me anytime. Well, you see, I kind of have a no-squids-allowed policy. You're pretty cool and everything, but, uh... You and Squidward, or whatever his name is, would probably... You know, get together and have little octopus children, and... Uh, I'm not really into it, sorry. I'm not down for squid diddling in my town. What is this, the Hall of Shame? What the fuck, Bob, Plague Rat, and Hopper. Hopper's so angry, he he can't even look at me. Hey, Yavine, how goes it? I thought I'd hang out in the burbs today. <laughs> Right, just spit all over my screen. That's good. This is not a case of the criminal returning to the scene of the crime. I didn't do anything! Yeah, tell yourself that. Polka dot chair. I thought it was a toilet. Let's see, what have you got here? Trash. And... a little bit more trash. Yeah. Scoot, I know you're just... I know what you're doing. I know you want to see Cyrus. I know that he's a hunky... Uh, uh you know... He jostles your duck feathers. I understand that. I, I get that he's got a bottle opener for your corkscrew. I don't even know what that means either. Yeah, the pizza room. There, that's all I have to say. Yeah, the pizza room. There, there was no other. And just a, a random. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm a fruit ninja. find all of you, I promise. Scoot! Captain. Cherry! Lucky! Scoot. Asshole! No one in town re replies to asshole. Wow, this megaphone fucking sucks. Here's one from Experiment, with a three in the middle. Dead inside, Mayor Vine, the thick one. From Salmiaki, uh, hello, Mayor, may I have your axe? Why? No reason. Here's one from Cure Cactus. <laughs> Simple, yet extremely effective. Turns out Coco was just, uh, studying squid anatomy. From Big Buff Cheeto Puff! Here's Cyrus and Scoot. This one's from Canada Hugs. I call to you, but you don't answer. From Wigarium Leviosa, we are not dead, you moron. I see dead villagers. It's just a cardboard cutout of Bob. This one's from Shrulu as well. Extra sweet and thick as fuck. What, what? Cherry's now advertising Mushmallow cereal. No wonder Cherry moved out of town. There were opportunities elsewhere. I mean, it's okay. We can all be trashed together. That's what we're all- we're united in- in one common goal. One common theme. And that is... bad trash.